The defeat of the GOP health care bill and the growing battle over Supreme Court nominee Neil Gorsuch have encouraged confidence in the Democratic Party. Many Democrats in Washington say they plan to work on efforts to, propose, to oppose President Trump's agenda, including representatives in Minnesota. One top priority is the fight against the president's plan to scale back on environmental and EPA regulations. Here's Esme Murphy with tonight's Talking Points. This past week, the president signed a bill rolling back almost all of President Obama's initiatives to reduce carbon emissions. It's just the latest move by the president, who campaigned promising to loosen regulations that environmentalists say are vital. The president maintains the rollbacks will stimulate jobs, especially in the economically depressed areas of the Midwest, including Minnesota's Iron Range. But Democratic members of Congress, including Minnesota Representative Betty McCollum, are fighting back. Congresswoman McCollum was a guest on WCCO Sunday morning. If we care about clean, safe drinking water, if we want to make sure that we're not uh, letting uh, the Great Lakes catch on fire again, if we're going to make sure that, that the air that we breathe doesn't contribute to early death, um, the EPA all has a role in that. The president's policy is also drawing fire from a number of Democratic governors, including Minnesota Governor Mark Dayton. Dayton is vowing Minnesota will continue to implement bipartisan plans to reduce harmful emissions and protect the environment. Esme Murphy, WCCO, 4 News. And you can watch WCCO Sunday morning with Esme Murphy and Micah Gustineck every Sunday at 6 a.m. and 10.30.